I want to share with you a site that has been around for a while, um, but you might not know about it. It's called Python Challenge, and it's a series of well, Python challenges that get progressively harder. So you visit the site and then you read through the instructions, click on challenge one, and then you have to progress through the various different challenges. I think there are 32 or so. I haven't completed them all. Uh, I first discovered this site a long time ago, years ago, and I think I completed, I don't know, a dozen or so of the challenges. And then I forgot all about it and I haven't touched it since. And I just remembered it the other day and thought it would be worth sharing. It's, um, it's quite a lot of fun. The challenges uh, get you thinking. They get you to use Python in various different ways and um, they're a lot of fun. I don't know how current they are because I haven't used it in such a long time, but it's certainly worth taking a look. So let's go and have a look at the site. Now the site looks like it's, it was designed in the 1990s, but don't let that put you off. So let's take a look. I'm not quite sure how, but I seem to be inside an old operating system. Hmm. Anyway, if you click on the link in the description, you can come and take a look too. Why would you want to do that? Well, by doing so, you can enter Break the Code 2022, where you'll face a series of challenges and puzzles. And if you solve them, you can win some prizes. You could win an exclusive Keanu Reeves signed script of The Matrix, a James Bond Goldeneye weapon system, a custom MacBook Pro, and the top prize for the best code breaker is a customized setup with the latest equipment worth $12,000. I've already entered the game and I've solved the first puzzle. They're not easy and I'm a bit stuck on puzzle two. Now the game comprises of four drives. So when you get into this operating system, you have access, first of all, to an email. You have to read that email. And then from that email, you have to work out how to progress onto the next stage. Once you've done that, you have access to the drives where you'll find the more difficult puzzles. A lot of thought's gone into this Break the Code 2022 by Dot Tech Domains. Just using the emulator is a lot of fun and the puzzles are challenging. You won't just be able to solve them straight away. I think you'll really enjoy doing it and there's the chance of winning some prizes. So why don't you just click on the link in the description and see what you think. Maybe, just maybe, you can solve all the puzzles. Okay, so here it is and you'll see what I mean. This is the site, so you can click here to get challenged and this is challenge one. Try to change the URL address. So it says 238 here. Um, so what happens if we go in here and type 238 and see where that takes us? No, the 38 is a little bit above the two. Okay, well, that's a good hint. So now we just want to do this to the 38. Okay, well, let's try this now. Uh, here we go. Okay, so we've done the first one. Right, so this is the second one now. I'm not going to go through them all with you. Uh, there are 32 of them. They get progressively more difficult. We'd be here for a very long time. But you get the idea. So... Go and take a look at the site and work your way through these challenges. There are solutions. I mean, if you just you know search for solutions, you'll be able to find them, but don't do that. Um, there are also solutions that are provided by the, the site too, but you can only access those once you've sold them yourself. And there's other information on the site that you can take a look at. But I just wanted to share that with you. I thought you might uh, enjoy doing it. I thought it might help you learn Python in a more interesting way and put your Python skills to the test. The link is in the description. I'll see you next time.